But we got more muscles here. We got Fumu versus Sky Raisin, Machamp versus Blaziken. Pretty interesting. He's, he's switching back to Blaziken. Uh, Fumu been on the Decidueye grind uh, since DX has dropped, and I think this is the first local he has gone all Blaziken. So he's pulled out Blaziken like, in some like pretty close matchups. Uh, but for the most part, really keeping with the Decidueye. So it's good to see him go back to the Fire Burb, the hot, the hot wing. Sky is getting grabbed there from the face It doesn't do a ton, so it's good. But then he whips right through his face and we're able to get a blaze kick off here. Combo inbound. Gets the wall stick. And the attack down. The attack down is huge on the champ. You really need to capitalize on him not doing damage to you. Because <laughs> that's, that's what my champ wants to do. So any damage that you can mitigate is, is good. You need to do it. Terry's so using the second hit of Frog here actually to go for the charge and to get in. Fumu just waiting for his opening to take the round here. Doesn't, there's not a need to go in. He goes in with the tried and true Blaze King combo. Yeah, Fumu taking it a little bit slower, knowing that he didn't, he just needed one hit to close out the round. Explaining frame data as he go, as he plays, yelling out that the regular blaze kicks is minus twelve. Three kicks are not punishable; they are enhanced. They take my they take my health. We got spicy fire checking on screen. His hair is all swooshed back like Kayachi. Ah! No wall stick. A little too far. Calling out Eevee, has a speed buff and an attack buff. Spicy. Now just the attack buff, now it's spicy. Ooh, the clap. Resetting patient points. This guy pushing towards the corner, but Fumu fighting right back goes and takes middle stage again. And there are eight hits. Who is 8x. Cross drop coming in for the phase change. Tries for the submission. Oh, heavy slam, not connecting. Goes for the bulk up. See if Sky blocks a few more of these hits, he could get meter. And he has Eevee. There's nice two white. Let's go for the reset, but gets the cross drop. Oh, oh, holy, holy, holy. Sky going for the ballsiest of call outs. If that would have been blocked, he would have been done, and that would have been the game. No, no, never mind. Puma won that one. My bad. So he had a round to work with. Still ballsy. Not as ballsy as I thought. Though. Still ballsy. So we're getting first. Catches the back dash. Try and get the attack down. Doesn't get it. Puts on the pressure. Jumps off of two wide. Enhance. Delays the movie first activation. Call on. Both Gaul and Eevee. Tries with the bull rush isn't gonna get it. This guy delays his super as well. Fumu having enough time to block. Cross cross. Oh, Sky uppercut. Try and get that attack down. Is he gonna get it? Oh no. Oh, oh my god. Then both players in a last hit situation. If Fumu able to close it out there with the flare blitz. You're facing him a champ. You have 200. You have around 230 HP left. You think you're good. You're winning the round. Everything's good. They call Eevee. You're like, nah, not a big deal. They have rage. You're like, oh crap. Then they get a they get a submission on you, and that takes 230 of your health. And you're like, what the hell just happened? I thought I was winning this game. The champ's like, no, nope, no burrito. This guy actually elected to go for Frog in this matchup. Uh, wants to put pressure on a field, most likely, or maybe even cover his approach in duel. I like it. Uh, Blaziken not really known to camp. Doesn't have a ton of projectile pressure. But if it helps him get in. Oh, nice awareness on positioning by Sky. Most of the time, it's a really easy confirm just to go for the. Uh, what's it called? 
It's not cross drop. I'm gonna call cross drop. The cross drop on the uh, to confirm off of the CA. This guy recognizing the, the wall is to his back, so it's gonna move full, move him a little bit closer to him, so he is able to get the full hold. Whoa, counter frames aren't gonna get through all of the sky effects. Are we gonna see a burst activation? No, no burst activation. Oh, okay. Round number two. To grab, getting the face change, getting his meter, goes for the 8x and push him down. All the Wata Tatas, that's punishable, not the right punish. Though. Whoa, very close. Let's say which one blinks first. Bad press in the 2y. Okay, pulling out frog. Is he gonna be able to? Nope, no, no confirm. That's plus. Hello plus. Uh oh, nope, not gonna catch. We got speedy chicken. He's getting caught by the cross drop. Calling crow gunk. Nice little berry. I like it for Kumu. He's really thought about this matchup. And he's like, I don't want you to cross this line. Yeah, that is really punishable. This guy could get a way bigger punish off of it, but he does give the reset. Wants the frog for wake-ups. Goes to a fake-out situation. Trying to get Fumu to react with the panic button, but Fumu not biting. Just walking in his face. This guy's like, I'm walking in your face. Slams him down. It's like, you are my basketball. Oh, last hit scenario. This guy able to get it with the clap. Fade away, clap. Going back to the character select screen, we've seen the support switch, we've seen the character switch. What are we gonna see? This is three out of five, so we have a couple steps to work with. Still sick and of spicy chicken, I like it. Yeah, I don't think I don't think uh Situ is great in this matchup personally. I think the champ CA just covers a lot of options. I think the situation has to work a little bit harder. Plus two wide just based in that matchup. But anyway, this matchup, Fire Chicken getting the first phase change. Both players playing footsies, respecting each other's options. He's been going to that 8x option to close the gap a lot. It's been working out for him pretty well. See, Sky using Frog Deer to cover his approach, gets the JY, but not able to get the confirm. Goes for the reset and he's rewarded. Corner. He now has the corner pressure. He got a crit submission. Pretty much in a champ dream. This is going to be a huge punish. Is this going to be game? It is. It's a great awareness by Sky. He had the corner. Able to capitalize heavily. Taking some time. Wants to go Eevee. I like the Frogger here. I think the Frogger here is helping him close the gap a lot. So, so it's just since both players are really respecting each other's footsie options or uh, neutral. From downtown submission. Because not much. I thought I thought it's safe when he's at first. Boom is Boom is teaching us as we go along, as he plays. Thanks, Boom. Appreciate it. Uh oh. Boom is screaming out in agony. Where's my red armor? Wants it. Needs it. The clap. No, nope, that was a light. That's a light. That's not a light. That's death. Guy up two to one here. 
He just kind of needs one more game to close that and move on to the grand finals. We move two sets. Both players, it's extremely close either way. So a lot of times, there's not a runaway round between the two a lot of times. Game number four. Puma we'll trying to zone a little bit with his side wide and the top two. It's like not a great option. Alright, so he's right in the corner, able to react to the submission. This can be a full conversion. Oh, nope. The champ, a little heavy, falls a little faster. Uh, so I'm not sure if he actually, I'm not sure if that's a character specific combo or not, I have to off ask after the match. Or actually, or maybe he went for the reset to try to keep it in duel. Had the advantage, so it's not that bad of an option. Frog covering the approach, gets in, jumps right back out. They're both players respecting their neutral options. Little... He's kind of able to capitalize, but does miss the wall carry. Tries for the hammer arm, but not even get it. Ooh, ducking and weaving, looking for the super. Oh, just misses it. Tons of damage coming out. Trying to get in so he can call a super. Mission hit. Punishes the frog. Now we'll take round number one. Champ shrugging it off. He's like, whatever, man. I got this fire chicken. Look at all these hands. Look at all these hands. I can hold so many fire chickens. I can hold four fire chickens in these hands. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Neutral wide, knocking them out. Enhance. Or unenhance. Uh oh. Big miss that, but. We'll be able to get a nice punish off of it. Bats away the shurikens. Calls the Eevee. Gets a little bit of health back. This guy resetting the finish his points and going for his super. Uh, just missed time. Just missed time the super attempt. It's gonna be a so much damage on Fumo. He still has the Eevee, he still has a lot of recoverable health. It's almost a super. And he's a living. We're living. We still he still got a super. I really like what Sky's doing, like kind of sitting in that mid-range and uh, going for the clap, because the clap has a really big hitbox, so if Fumu had ever decided to jump out of that situation, it would have caught that. So I really like his uh, his utilization of that now. Oh, let's see. Wasting the bolt up stock. Fuma trying to zone a little bit. Fuma needs to be very careful. He has full resources, so in case he gets in too much trouble, he can burst out of it. Able to get a lot of damage here and gets the attack down. Delays the last hit, but not able to get the phase change. Yeah, if him, I would pop super right now. Reset the phase shift points, keep the champ in the corner. Yeah, but Champ didn't have any resources there. I would like to see him keep in the corner, but now it's, but now it's in field. Now he can call Super when he's in advantage. One more hit here. We'll close it out for Fubu for this round. And it's a grab. All right, we are going to game number five here between Sky Racing and Fumo. Woo -woo. Kano's jumping up and down for excitement, throwing his cap in the air with reckless abandonment. You think, I'm gonna suck the souls out of everything in this room. Cappy, away. Both players taking a second. Recollecting themselves. Going back to the character select screen, are we gonna see a change? No, okay. Both players are kind of taking some time to recollect themselves. Maybe a support change, cheer skill change, anything along those lines to kind of counter our opponent. Kind of your opponent from the last round, not a bad idea. Sticking with the same characters, we did see a support change on Sky's screen, going with the Rotom Togu Kiss. 
I really like Frog. I really like Frog in that matchup for him. I think he was doing really well with it, but... Rush up coming in. Who will able to get the face into neutral A? A next to Quebec Afghanistan. He's getting a lot of mileage from Fubu in this matchup. He's been doing really well for him. Not able to outlast the overheat. And then misspaces the JX as well. Uh oh. Trying to get a slow blaze again. Not able to get it. Blaze again now having first and EV. Clap resets face shift points. Now Fubu's in the corner. Now he's not in the corner. This is a lot of damage. Oh my goodness. Token Kiss come in. That is nice. Those, these both are speedy. My god, look at them race around. Full charge to break the shield. Here comes the pressure. This guy able to jump out. What's the punish? Uh, oh god. This might not kill. Oh, but kill. Nope, it killed. Well, that last punch, man. Does a lot. I thought he would have been a little too high, maybe. Uh, I don't know what the last punch would have lift. That was a great punish by Sky. Oh, we got a red armor. Uh, no. No, no, we won. Food was sitting in about half health. This guy going in actually delays that a little bit. I like it. Oh no, the champ's at, the champ's at the corner, one grab is going to take a pulse energy burst, Fumu's in a real rough spot, and that's going to be it. And that is it. Hard fought fight between those two, Fumu putting up a heck of a fight between Sky. Uh,